Whew. All right. Hey guys, it's uh, DJ Last Pirate here, and today we have a review, or not a review, but more like an overview of the Kraken Clone Trainer. So, yeah. So, here it is. I got mine original. Oh god, that's actually kind of a fall. Alright, well, let's talk. Um, so, I got mine basically right when they released. Uh, this is the first color that they had it out in, which is the orange. Uh, they have two other colors. Um, dual tone blue and dual tone black. But, uh, they weren't exactly available yet. So, yeah. Um, they do actually have live blades now. And it's the, uh, Tanto, not Bowie. But, uh, yeah. So, yeah. Here we go. Um, so to start off. No tap. So. And the play. Very minimal play. So. And this is all stock, by the way. I haven't, you know, I haven't changed the screws. And I haven't tuned the bushings or anything. This is all stock. So. Uh, yeah. So the balance is very similar to a real Kraken. Very neutral. Um, but it still does rollovers and fanning fantastic. Um, it does everything, you know, very well. Uh, just like a real Kraken would. Um, and yeah, overall, this is a fantastic flipper. Uh, I also haven't oiled this either, and it's still pretty smooth. So. Ooh. Ah. Rip, I had a combo going there. Ah, oh, first drop on concrete. Ooh, that hurt the soul a little bit. Any damage? Oh. A little bit. Whatever, I kind of expected it. Probably gonna beat this thing anyways. But, no biggie. So, these retail at $45. Same price point as the Triton clone. But this is actually much better than the Triton clone. Um... It is very blocky, as you can see. The corners aren't sharp though, you know, like the Triton clone. Triton clone corners were a bit iffy. So, you know, I kinda need to sand those down to do chokers and stuff. But, nope, this is uh, pretty good. Um, the cutouts on the uh, bottom of the handles much more prominent than the uh, than the real Kraken. The real Kraken has, uh, they're kind of shallow. They're not very deep cuts. These are a tiny bit sharp, but they're not like um, sharp. Like they can very like grip on to my finger. So they gotta be really good for uh, ladders and stuff. So that's good at least. Ah, oh, man, I just cannot get a shortstop on camera. Can I? All right, hold on. Wait, I gotta get a shortstop really quick. There we go. Sorry, I just need to prove to myself that I can still do them. Um, but no, this thing is fantastic. The crown or the spine is very crowned, very smooth for uh, chaplains, you know. And the uh, back in about the corners of the bottom of the handles, I can still do chokers really well on this. So they're not really sharp. And even with, you know, the cutouts on the bottom, like they don't really get in the way, so that's really good. Um, this also does have a bite handle nub right there. Um, it's not like Squid Industries, so it's not going to be really, really uncomfortable. But you do notice it, which is good, so it does its job. Um, now, the cutouts in the uh, the blade 
aren't sloppy. They are actually really well done. Um, if I can show those tiny ones. Um, they are really well done. They don't have any, like, massive issues with the cutouts. A little bit of stuff right there. I'm going to guess that's when I dropped it on concrete, but whatever. Um, but yeah, no, these are, uh, this is a fantastic clone. They did a really, really good job on this. Now, with the actual texturing on the handles, they aren't that good. Um, they're there, like, they are very, very shallow. Um, I can only barely, um, feel it with my finger now. Even, like, if I'm going in the direction, like, the flats, I can only barely feel them. But if I'm going, like, from the top down, might as well be smooth. It's, the texturing isn't really there, which sucks because that was kind of one of the things I was really excited about because they did a pretty good job with the EX-10. Um, but, you know, it doesn't bother me that much. Uh, it is actually a different um, pattern than the real Kraken. As you can see, it's a little different. So, but it is still really effective. Um, because it's not slippery like the Triton, which is good. God, I'm really bad at flipping today. Sorry about that. But, um... So it is very, uh, neutral. I'd say very, very, very slight blade bias. And I mean slight. Like, barely there. But, it can still do roll rollovers and cra uh, chaplains. I almost said krakens. <laughs> it can do rollovers and chaps really, really well. So, I'm not really worried about the balance. And of course, it does fanning really well. So, but uh, yeah, that's just a quick little overview of this guy. Um, yeah, sorry. It once again, it's kind of all over the place. I wish my videos were much better quality, but they're not. So hopefully, you can deal with my uh, garbage video here. Um, but uh, yeah, that's where this is at. It's the Kraken clone. Um, I, I guess I guess that's it. I don't know. We've been going on for like eight minutes now. Uh, yeah. See ya. Oof.